hello everyone and welcome to this tips and tricks video and in this one I'm going to show you something cool so I always talk about how you should format your code properly I, I, I do it uh, when I'm writing code so but people are very lazy and so am I and uh, I was talking to a friend of mine Akash who is a computer vision expert um, he told me about this uh, code formatting tool called black so as you can see in the background um, so black is a tool which doesn't require too many configurations and you can format your code very very easily using black so today I'm going to show you how you install black and how you use it so now we have uh, the bird sentiment repository so I will run black on it and then see um, what happens and black is also my favorite color so let's try <laughs> let's uh, let's see so we will go to our terminal let me first clear all this and we install black so installing black is easy pip install black i already have it so we don't need it <clears throat> So now I will create a new branch. Um, uh, let's call it black. And uh, what I have here is this source directory. Um, I think it has all the Python files. So let's let's run black on it. So to run black, you need to run the command black minus t by 37 so minus t is the target by 37 is python 3.7 since we are using python 3.7.6 and uh, then i say src slash and it reformatted a bunch of files okay let's add all of them and let's commit format code using black okay and now we uh, push it And um, should be done. Okay. Now I'll go to the repo and I see the branch is created here. Uh, so I'm just going to make a pull request. Format code using black, create a pull request uh, to master. And then I can check the files change. So I can see, like, okay, it has inserted one empty line because you should have two empty lines before the function. And black also has a parameter for max line length. So I think it's uh, 88. I'm not sure by default, you can change that one. Uh, so you have, uh, so I was doing like this, but uh, like, like this one, I have one um, argument in every line. You can do that or you can just have it in one line if it fits. So wherever it fits, it will, black will put it in one line and black also likes double quotes so it has changed all my single quotes to double quotes which is okay i can live with that and it also likes to add a trailing comma which is also fine so that's used because if you add something new after this line you won't be changing two lines you will be changing only one line of code uh, but this one probably yeah this one looks like it's quite good right so black is doing a lot of nice things and then what I do is I just go to the pull request and I'm gonna merge it and my code is formatted so the idea about black is you can write code any way you want and it's just going to format it very nicely for you so um, you don't have to care about uh, um, a standard while writing the code but you just write your code your way the way you want run black and that's it right um, if you like it then like subscribe and share and uh, put a comment uh, and tell me if, what you want to see in the next videos and I'll try to make it happen thank you very much goodbye